Uh, my name's Eric Lowe, and I'm with at and I'm the Vice President of International External Affairs there. So with at and I support all of our clients that have international interests, and we do operate around the world, and uh, in one form or another uh, have services that touch just about every country. And so we work with governments around the world as well as multilateral institutions, and of course the parts of the U.S. government that have international interests as well. So the, uh, the conference in Dubai, the World Conference on International Telecommunications, was held by the, the ITU. And this conference has been uh, the culmination of work over several years to update a treaty document called the International Telecommunications Regulations, last updated in 1988. The, the U.S. was coming in to the conference with uh, um, concerns about not extending old rules to a new environment. It is critical uh, for us to be clear when we say internet. And certainly from uh, our perspective, it is not only internet content and services, it is internet IP networks and internet interconnection agreements as well. And so we need to keep that broad perspective in mind as we think about policy. And the starting point for the U.S. to be credible in its outreach is to have a consistent position in the United States on this. And so that, that uh, we have to continue with. It's really very important. Uh, in, in terms of the outreach that can be done, uh, I, I am a believer that you have to outreach with everyone. Those you have already persuaded, those who you feel you can persuade, and even those who you can't persuade, because you have to have a dialogue. And we are a company that operates in every country. Look at the CES and you look at CEA and you, you see the result of innovation uh, across the ecosystem. You see that the codependence between everything that is here and on display and the services and the environment that has created that. So the, 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 the proof case for continuing this model is strong and the uh, number of parties who are, who are here and part of this is, is a uh, perhaps previously untapped opportunity to bring more people into the conversation and into the outreach. And so I think that's an, ex I truly think it's an exciting opportunity.